Hey, what's up guys? My name is Nick Arapkalis. Uh, if you're watching this video, it probably means that you want to get a little bit more information on why you need to read books and what it really is going to help you with. So stay tuned. All right, guys, again, my name is Nick. And again, what I want to talk about on this video is all about books and reading books and why exactly you want to read books. So the reason you want to read books, I mean, I know in the beginning, like when I was young, you know, I kind of, I kind of learned to like books um, in the beginning. I read, I remember when I was in an elementary school, I was reading just these goofy novels and they're cool enough, but I kind of grew out of reading and it, it certainly did not help me through high school and college because, you know, reading is so essential in those points of life but I just I never could grasp it but then I kind of after I got out of college is when I started reading more ironically because I got into a business and they really taught you principles on why you want to read and I actually just got back from an event and they even illustrated it even more and it just keeps on going into my head why exactly I want to read books and the reason is because you become a product of what you read Okay, so if you're reading gossip magazines, you're going to eventually become a product of that. And when I say product, it's just like you're going to be speaking that more. That's going to be in your subconscious and that's what's going to be on your mind always. But at the same time, what you want to do if you want to have success in life, you want to be reading solid books that are going to help you grow your mind because growing your mind is so essential to success. So if you want to be if you want to be having success in your life, you want to be reading successful books, personal development books. I mean, some of my favorites are Secrets of the Millionaire Mind, uh, The Secret Code of Success by Noah St. John. I love Les Brown, Zig Ziglar, just all those types of people. If you want more recommendations, just click the or make a comment below, and I'll give you more recommendations. Or um, I actually I wrote a blog post all about this, so I'll include a bunch of those books on there as well. So go check that out, nickarapkalis.com, and you can see all that. But again, you just want to be doing this, and you want to be doing this on a consistent basis. You want to be reading every single day. If it's 10 minutes, that's fine. If, it's, if you can do 30 or 40 or an hour, that's even better. But doing it on a consistent basis. It's better re to read 10 minutes a day, seven days a week, than it is to read 30 or 40 minutes for one day a week. Okay, I hope that makes sense. I'm sure it does. But again, you just want to continually be reading, continually growing your mind because it's similar to eating and your nutrition. You're always going to be putting something in to your mouth and something you're always going to be, that's always going to help or hurt your body. It's the same thing with your mind. Things are always coming into your mind regardless of if it's good or bad. So you want to be putting good things. You want to be intentional about it because success is, comes from intention. Okay, putting thing, good things in your mind on a consistent basis is going to help you out and, you know, become a product. You'll become a much more successful person when you have a, a subconscious mind that's always just directed to success. Okay, so again, make sure and check out my blog post. I wrote all about this type of stuff at nickarapkalis.com and uh, just start reading, start doing it. Uh, something I will let you know about too is that something I actually like to do is read audio book or listen to audio books more so. I feel like I can do that a little quicker and I can also take notes at the same time. I think taking notes is a very important thing. Something else that might help you retain a little bit better is actually after you're done reading, just kind of talk about to yourself or you know anybody else you want, talk to what, talk about what you just read. And that helps you kind of ingrain it a little bit better. You can take notes, that too. All right, guys. Well, thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, smash that like button, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Um, I'll be putting out a lot, a lot of more cool videos like this one. So thanks for watching. We'll talk to you soon.